Before we begin this video, here's a quick and an easy question for you all. Can you all tell us the date on which the movie The Grey Man is going to release? If you know the right answer, let us know in the comment section down below or stick to the end of the video, which is when I'm going to reveal the answer to this question. Hey guys and welcome to the celebrity expert show number one source for all things TV shows and celebrities and in today's video we're gonna look at Ryan Gosling and Chris Evans bromance. You insultingly call Ryan Gosling's character a Ken doll. I do. But like now he really did play Ken. Look, see? So Lloyd knows what's up. He can yeah. see into the future, he knows. How does it feel now knowing you, you beat up Ken? Right, well. <laughs> We beat each other up, you sure. know, I feel like it's kind of an even match. Ryan Gosling is living out his dreams. He is going to face Chris Evans in a high-powered spy flick, The Grey Man. After always wanting to work in an action movie, he told The Hollywood Reporter during the Netflix film's premiere on Wednesday that he finally got to do it. He seems like a fun guy to pair up with. Yeah, yeah, it's a little intimidating, you know, it's, it's Ryan yeah, Gosling, it's he's, Ryan he's a presence. I mean, I mean Chris I'm sure, Evans. I'm <laughs> sure, well, listen, I'm sure you've met him. I mean, he's, <laughs> he's a very... Uh, a very centered person. Mm -hmm. I think that's that's what's that's the origin of why he's such a good actor. That that I yeah. think, uh, you know, he himself is very much um, unbothered. You know, <laughs> and and that's that's uh, it's it's. It's, it's the qualities you look for in a leader. Mm -hmm. Though the movie is packed with stunt sequences which he said were challenging in the best way, the film's standout may very well be Chris Evans' mustache, which Gosling's character refers to as trash stash. What does Gosling himself think of Chris Evans' facial hair? He confirmed, those were my thoughts. You and Chris go head to head in this movie. What was it like filming those fight sequences with him? It was fun, you know, I always wanted to make an action movie, so I finally got to do it. I was, I, I thought it was exciting. Now in the film, your character calls Chris Evans' mustache a trash stash. What are your real thoughts on his mustache in the movie? Those were my thoughts. Yeah. Fair enough. As for Ryan Gosling's next career highlight, he's hard at work for the movie Barbie in instantly viral photos captured during the filming in which he's being starred as Ken. Ryan is an unbelievable ad libber. It's really funny. That scene specifically, um, they, they they just released the clip where I kind of spray him with mace. And, yeah. And every time he kind of has his eyes closed, sprayed with that mace, he would just kind of, every take, just, just riff on, on why he thought that I was Lloyd. Both performers coast on their by now well-established personas and respective assets. The Russo's seem especially invested in highlighting Chris Evans' biceps and hips, but Gosling projects enough confidence and charm to make you want to keep watching. Uh, how jealous were you of, of Chris rocking that nice guy's tash? Oh yeah, that's right. Um, yeah, when Chris came with, this, with the trash dash and the, the whole thing, it was, it was a it was exciting because I knew that this movie, you know, a movie's only, a hero's only as good as its villain. And so when he showed up, I thought, okay. After playing our beloved Captain America in the MCU films, Chris Evans is all set to weave the same magic in his upcoming movie, The Grey Man. In this movie, Chris Evans will be stepping into the shoes of an antagonist named Lloyd Hansen, and he will be seen as a sociopath while Ryan Gosling will play the titular role. You know, Chris ran mustache first <laughs> into this role. <laughs> and he had a lot of fun playing mm. it mm. and uh, I you know it was a lot of fun to play against that yeah ahead of the release of the highly awaited American action thriller film Chris Evans recently took to his social media handle and shared an interesting revelation with his fans where he stated that he hit Ryan Gosling in the face on the day one of filming the gray man every part of the character is uh, something that helped bring it to life and you know whether it's the mustache, the haircut, the wardrobe, all those little pieces help uh, bring the character into clarity. Let's go. I'm good. Let's go. It sounded like a question. But before we jump into the next video, here's a quick shout out to our Instagram page, TCE Filmonger. If you are someone who would love to get your daily dose of celebrity news and other movie updates, then this is a one-stop shop. Recently, Chris Evans took to his Instagram stories and shared a new clip from his upcoming film. Sharing the video, Chris Evans revealed that he accidentally hit Ryan Gosling on his face while shooting. Chris Evans wrote, My first day of filming, I accidentally hit Ryan in the face with a gun. Yeah, I just posted something recently. That was the first day of filming with him. 
and I accidentally hit him right in the face. I was holding the gun as I slam him into the wall. And, you know, you had the gun in the hand and you slam into the wall and the gun just boom, right off of his front lip. Woof. Despite debunking Nova casting rumors, Ryan Gosling suggests that he would be interested in joining the Marvel Cinematic Universe as Captain Canada. Born in Canada and having done many types of movies, especially both in indie and blockbuster films of various genres, Ryan Gosling is interested to join the MCU as Captain Canada and now he's going to play a CIA on the run in the movie The Grey Man opposite Captain America actor Chris Evans. Yeah, he's he's wonderful. I mean, he's uh, like I said, he's constantly committed. Um, he's a very giving actor. He, he understands that acting is a is a team sport. You know, I've I've been on a few films where you really feel isolated from the other performers. Ryan is very much uh, concerned with making sure you are also comfortable and content and happy with 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 how the scene's going. Though Gosling seems to be joking about playing Captain Canada, Marvel would likely to have him in any role possible. If the two sides are able to work out a deal for the two-time Academy Award nominee to join the Marvel Cinematic Universe, he will join the growing wave of A-listers who have recently hopped on board the franchise. When I was talking to Ryan, he said that he would love to be a part of the MCU. What do you think about that? You think Did he say that? Me? Yes, he did say that. He did. Did he say that? Yeah. I I would not <laughs> lie to you. I mean, look, the MCU is uh, consistently making good movies and so I think a lot of people are giving them their 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 rightful credit and then recognizing that they make some really really great pieces of film. Yeah, he'd be great in it, yeah. right? Yeah. Um on first day of set, did right. you ever get him back and was it accidental? Hmm. That's a good question. <laughs> You'd have to ask him. I don't know. Yeah. <laughs> but, you know, acting is a great job. You yeah. get free health care. You know, you get free meals. You get driven to work. Life's good. Every once in a while, you get a gun in the mouth. There you go. It's a small <laughs> price to pay. We start that in January, so luckily there are a few other productions who are kind of the canary in the mine shafts right now. They're, they're, they're giving it a shot, so I guess we'll see how that goes. I mean, you know, within all the contracts, it's like, you know, assuming we're able to choose. Um, no one's going to shoot unless it's safe for everybody involved. So again, there's a couple of people who are first in the pool and we'll see how those things go and see if we can modify and make things as safe as possible. And if not, we won't go. All right, guys, that's it for today's video. And the answer to the question as you're at the beginning of the video is July 22nd, 2022. If you got this answer right, then you are a true fan of Chris Evans and Ryan Gosling and Anna the Armas. All right, guys, we'll see you around next time with another brand new video. Till then, keep watching this celebrity expert. Bye, guys.